Hey and howdy! I am Coach Megan. And I'm Coach Akila. And you remember Coach Akila from the double partner cartwheels? <laughs> Check out the video. Anyways, we're gonna show partner stretches for gymnastics, and this could work for dance too. Or if you're, hey, just wanna get more flexible and you know, do it with someone else. It's more fun, you know? So the first one we're gonna do is a pike stretch working on our toe point and our hamstring flexibility. So the both of you want to sit at a pike. This is a pike stretch. Nice straight legs. One person's going to have their feet on top of the feet of your partner and push their feet down with your, with your feet. I know, it's like crazy, huh? And then you're slowly going to reach like this, grab fingertips. Decide who's going to pull first. You can pull me first, Akila. Go ahead and count to 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Then I'm going to pull her. Or actually, we're going to switch our feet because then she can stretch my toes and I'll pull her. Now, the, the person being pulled, um, let the other person know if your arms are going to fall off or <laughs> you know, you're going to dislocate your arm because you don't want to go nuts here. You want to get a nice Nice, painful stretch, but not pain in a bad way. Do you know what I mean? Uh, okay. <laughs> so the next one is going to be one more foot thing. My coach Nikolai used to stretch our feet all the time, and it was amazing, and it really did help our toe point. So you're going to grab the top of the foot, and you're gently going to push down. So you don't want to grab the toes and be like, <sighs> I don't want to like break your toe. <laughs> so, you know, just ease into it. And then you're just gonna hold it like that. Can you feel it? Mm -hmm. It really, you know, it's a nice stretch. And just try and keep your legs nice and tight and your heels together. And you can even flex and push back like that. It's quite relaxing actually. Just, you know, don't kill them too much there. Second one is gonna be a partner small straddle stretch. I know that's a mouthful, but whatever. So you're gonna sit in a straddle. You don't wanna be too close to each other because then you don't get as good of a stretch. You can start close and pull one person and then I'll scooch back for the next one. Nice tight legs. Again, let her be the communicator. You must communicate in this world to get ahead and to be safe. And is that, can you feel anything? Okay, great. And I'm gonna scooch back a little for mine. Because if you're more flexible, then you can get a better pull. And notice how we're grabbing. I grab her wrists, and then she grabs the inside of my wrists. And it just makes for a better um, stretch her size. So pull. Awesome. One, two, three. And make sure your legs are nice and tight. Four. I can really feel it. Five, six, seven, eight. Amazing. Okay, and then also in this small straddle, the partner can push on the back end in the pipe too. I'll just show you the straddle though. So she's going to reach forward and you want to push, see how I'm going on like the lower back more? Because some kids will push up here and that kind of hurts my back sometimes. I think it's safer if you stick to this lower back and tell this person, breathe in Akila. And breathe out. And when they breathe out, it, it allows them to go down just a little bit more. Awesome. Can you feel it? Yes. Are you alive? I'm alive. I'm not killing you. No. Okay, great. <laughs> okay, so moving on to the next stretch. Shoulders. So this one, you can either go on the knees or standing. I'll just go on the knees. And she's just going to gently lift my arms up. And once again, the, the person that is me, I, that made no sense, but you know what I mean. The person that's being stretched. Exactly. You have to let them know, like, okay, that's about good for me, so stop, red light, and then hold it for about 10 seconds, 10, 9, 8, 7, because gymnastics requires a lot of shoulder flexibility. Finally, you can go against a wall. Okay, so this one's going to get your splits going. We're going to do the one for dance first. So in gymnastics, we keep our hips and shoulders square, which I don't know where they got that from, maybe because the square has straight edges, but square means straight shoulders, straight hips, and dance a lot of times is more turned out. So her leg's gonna be turned out in this one. 
So she's going to stand nice and tall up against the wall. She's going to give me one leg. And this person, this, the uh, stretcher, is going to kind of, you got to get in there, you know? You don't want to be like, Ooh. you got to get under her leg. I put under her Achilles and I slowly straighten up. And she is going to try to work on keeping that bottom leg straight. And we're just going to pull as far as you can. And then you want to hold it if you can for like 30 seconds to a minute. Okay, it's a good arm workout too. Make sure you bend those knees. See how I'm getting under her leg? Can I go any higher? And once again, communicate. More, okay, so this, she says this is good. So notice she's a little turned out to the side. Okay, and this one's, it's a nice stretch and it just, you know, it gets the job done. <laughs> and remember with flexibility, we'll do the other leg, not for as long just so you can get the idea. With flexibility, see I get under like this, and then, yeah. So you're kind of going to the side a little more on this one. Um, yeah, you gotta do your stretching at least three times a week, right? Yes. Because if you only do it like once a month, it's sorry. Sorry, Charlie, it's just not gonna happen. Okay, so great job with you. And now I'm gonna do the square gymnastics way. This is much harder, by the way, so. Don't um, get discouraged if you can't go that far. So I'm gonna, you can go higher. I'm gonna keep this and this straight. Great. A little higher. Keep it going. Keep, wow, my legs work really <laughs> well today. You can go a little higher. A little more, a little more. And finito, stack. One, two, and then, you know, just hold it. Think of nice things. Uh, Waterfalls, <laughs> roller coaster maybe, I don't know. Great, okay, now we'll go to the other side. Remember to stand up really tall, I forgot to say that. Try not to pop this bottom hip out because a lot of kids will do that. For this side, I'll go here so you can see me. Hopefully I don't fall through the curtain <laughs> and interrupt the people next door. Yikes. So nice and straight. Oh boy. Good, and this is my bad leg. Remember, one leg's gonna be harder than the other. Ay, 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 okay, stop. Yeah, I can feel it. And then you just hold it, stand up nice and tall. Everything's straightened out, and release. There you go. Okay, it's time for end of the workout trick. We'll see you there. <laughs> Cartwheel yourself silly. Thanks guys.